Walking with God is not for the weak and do not expect for it to be all rainbows and sunshine when you come to God. You should actually expect the quite opposite because there's going to be a lot of spiritual warfare over your life when you follow Jesus. That is given. The enemy does not want you to have relationship with God because he was banned from God's presence and he will be eternally suffering. And so the enemy is going to do whatever he can to get you from freedom in Christ. The devil is going to send so many attacks. He literally knows your weaknesses. He knows what can get you to stumble. And so he sends demonic spirits operating through people, monitoring spirits to try and get you to fall into sin. The devil is a liar. It is important that when you are going through spiritual warfare, spiritual attacks, that you are staying prayed up and in the word of God. It's the only thing that's gonna help you overcome the demonic systems and patterns and temptations of this world. You are going to be tempted. When you come to God, all of your problems are not going to disappear. But God does promise to give us the strength we need when we're going through the suffering. And that's what I love about walking with God is that he gives us comfort and peace in the middle of the storm where most people might be shaken up situations that would break most people or shake them up we are going to be standing firm in faith because we know that we serve a god who is bigger and has already overcome this world and so there is nothing that we can possibly go through that can overpower us absolutely nothing when you have the power of the holy spirit working in you nothing that the devil throws at you can break you because you have god who is greater than this world and so I don't know who needs to hear this, but stand firm in faith, okay? Stand firm in your authority. Recognize the power that you walk with. When you are a child of God, you now have the creator of this universe on your side. And the Bible says, if God is for you, who can be against you? No one. Stay encouraged and remember Jesus loves you.